there's one thing this city's taught me. You can put a price on anything. Secrets, reputations, a life. And trust? If you have to ask, you can't afford it. But then I suppose none of that matters when you're me. After all, when did I ever pay for anything? Well, they do call the rooftops the Thieves Highway. I just hope that's not who I think it is. Aaron. Of course it is. Care to make a little more noise next time? How else would you know it was me? Basso did tell you we were working together on this, right? Well, I showed up, so what do you think? <laughs> I think you haven't changed a bit. Come on, it'll be just like old times. Glad you could make it. Did you pick that route because it was fast or because he thought it'd be fun? Can it be both? Come on, let's get Basso his commission. Are you going to use any of those shadows, Lady Lamplight? I was just scouting ahead. I know you always like to go first. You should get yourself one of these. See you on the other side. Looks like I won't be going that way. Let's finish unloading before summer's day is over. Why not drink to a job well done first? We, we can't just leave the cart out here. It's festival time. Your average thief will be under a table in an alehouse. And the watch will be liquored up too. I'm not haggling fines with a drunk guard again. Garrett, come on. Jealous of the claw? I made it myself. I'm sure the watch will be very impressed. They'll certainly hear us coming. They'll have to catch me first. Just be aware of your surroundings. It's not about taking in the sights, Garrett. It's about taking in the loot. You do still steal, right? I've been stealing since before you could crawl. There's the Garrett I know. How about a friendly wager? Let's see who can take in the most. Look what I found. Oh, you and me out on the town? Why did we stop doing this again? Do you really need to ask? Hard to keep a secret in this neighborhood. How much did you steal? <laughs> it's not how much you steal. It's what you steal. And how you steal it. <sighs> Looks like this primal stone thing that Basso wants is in the ceremony room at Northcrest Manor. It's the Baron's mansion.
won't be easy. Worried? Yes, and so should you. We'll be fine. I'll pick up your slack. <sighs> this job's getting more complicated by the second. That's a lot of guards. They're definitely not here for the summer festival dance. A lot of guards means a lot of steel. Thieves and swords do not get on well. I've never had a problem with swords. But then again, I'm not just a thief. We can't let the Baron's guests see this thing giving out. And we can't freaking see without it. Ah, they go off and on all the time. So you can't fix it? Every time I get it going, it fizzles out again. You couldn't set a cloth aflame if it was doused in oil, son. I'll show you how it's done. If you pack it together too close, then the air won't feed the flames. Uh, I should know better. My family used to be charcoal burners. Oh, yeah? <laughs> That's work you don't see much since the factories came. Huh? Oh, come on. What? I need to take him down quickly, quietly. Wrong place, wrong time. You haven't changed, have you? What's that supposed to mean? It means I don't kill without thought or good reason, and I don't get paid for it. So basically it's okay when you do it, but not me. I see. I get it. But you know that guard? He's not gonna wake up later and follow our trail to cause trouble. When any guards wake up, I'm usually long gone. If you're so eager to leave, maybe I should go first. You're holding me back. Relying on that claw is holding you back. <clears throat> ah. You worried I might beat you to this thing? I'd share, probably. I'm worried you're gonna get us both killed. I can handle myself, okay? I can move faster, I can climb faster, I can... You can kill faster and make mistakes faster, I get it. You're not in control. Well, that's why I'm better. <laughs> Deal with it. Let's just get the job done. I think we'll do it without this. I'm guessing that's what we're after, the Primal Stone. Robes. Robes are always a bad sign. Brothers Cornelius, Aldous, present the keys. This Baron Northcrest. Brothers of the Awakened, we are gathered here to usher this city into a new age. One of progress and industrial enlightenment. Let us begin the channeling of the primal. Sembla and Straka Khan. Scare Mama Kana. Come on, let's go down there. This will be fun. No. We're done here. Job's over. What? Are you joking? Something's not right. It's too dangerous. And you're not ready yet. You know, I'm not a kid anymore. I can do this. I'm going down there with or without you. Not without this, you're not.
Looks like he's waking up. Come on. Stop slacking. We gotta get him in the city before they call the lockdown. Pace yourself, boy. We just need to get him to the clock tower. Safe and sound, and then we'll be rosy. Where's this car going? Baker's in Stone Market. <clears throat> Was I talking to you? Hey! Get moving! Fucking beggars. Makes you miss the old watch. The voices! Stop the nightmares! <laughs> the gloom's getting worse. Everywhere except Oldale. Someone should do something. Nobody gives a shit about us, boy. You'll learn that soon enough. All he cares about is progress. You want to see more of these bloody pipes everywhere? You are the boss. That's enough. Do you? That's not food for our bellies. That's not medicine for the sick. You don't think you're safe because you've got a job shoveling shit for the rich. The Baron has a noose for every one of us. But change is coming. Orion is going to bring change. The Baron will burn. Uh, see? See? They're scared of the truth. Keep your head down. Do that. Who are you speaking with? Run! Stop! I feel like I can think and act faster than normal when I concentrate. What happened to me? Jennifer. Pickle jar bass a lot more weight. Garrett. Shit. I see you still can't work a door. You don't come to see me, you don't write. 
I thought both you and Aaron had been killed in the mansion attack. Where the hell have you been? I don't know. You don't know? <laughs> Fine. Forget it. Far be it for me to pry about where you've been for the last fucking year. <coughs> I don't have time for this. <sighs> Especially with the Baron's new duty on opium, thanks to this gloom sickness. Not to mention the Thief Taker General's black tax squeezing us entrepreneurs. If you got a job for me, let's hear it. <laughs> Are you sure you're up to it? Okay, so, here's the gig. <laughs> I need you to obtain a ring for me. Getting married? <laughs> Never again. <coughs> ah, you mangy bird. I swear one day I'm gonna have you made into a hat. And lose the brains of the uh, outfit. <laughs> I'm running out of fingers. <laughs> Good job, Basil. Good yeah, job. yeah, 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 right. Uh, belongs to a guy named uh, Cornelius Greaves, one of those hoity-toity types who doesn't have any shit on his boots. Ah, ah. here you go. What's the catch? Uh, he's dead. I'm a thief, Basso, not a grave robber. Only recently deceased. My sources say he never took the ring off. Doesn't seem much of a challenge. Ah, challenge. We'll be getting to him before the Carters pick him over. Rumor has it they've been taking bodies to that old, uh, foundry near Cinderfall. Crawling with the Baron's guards for some reason. Now, best way to that place is through the old chapel. <laughs> and, uh, don't screw this up, Garrett. Some of us still need to pay our dues. You can't tax what you can't catch. <laughs> Get out of here. And you use the door, please. <laughs> Still, it's good to see you. Huh. It's a lonely night. It's the best kind. Mm. Uh, Garrett, you walk a path few would wish. That's the only one I know. Mm. Quite. You know what they say about me. That you know everything that happens in this city. Not everything. Just the important things. What brings you here? Seeking my counsel? A year ago, I was at the Northcrest Mansion. Something went wrong. What happened to me? What happened to Aaron? A year ago. Men who believed themselves to know best tried to control something they didn't fully understand for their own ends. The balance has shifted. We can all feel it. That's your answer. When my beggars found you, after the accident, they thought you were dead. But you were not dead. So we healed your broken body, and brought you from the city to... to keep you safe, while we waited. But then... Just after the gloom started, something began to wake you. It was time for you to return home. This city grows sick. It will tell you all in time, if you choose to listen. Careful, Garrett. There are worse things in the shadows than you.
officers. We've been hauling corpses since dawn. We just want this day to be done. Did you hear this lazy gutter sight? Consider yourself lucky you're pulling that card and not in it. Now move! I'll find my own way in. I need to rest. I'm sure I stashed it up here. Crap. I'll never find it again in this murk. Mannequins. I came here looking for a body. But not this kind. This wouldn't pass for respect in a slaughterhouse. Poor old Cornelius must already be on the line. The best way to follow Cornelius is to put my life on the line. Break's over. Let's get the line running again. I wonder if a building can be condemned twice. I want you making a good case for it here. Jobs well and without question will be justly rewarded. Oh. Hey, I'm Dead man, Cornelius is proving hard to catch. But I'll have to if I'm to pawn Whoa, that Oh, hey, one at a time. No pushing. <laughs> Flames ain't going anywhere without you. No matter if you're rich or ragged. I don't care if your mother's got the fucking gloom, she's not coming to live with us. Yeah! <laughs> you should take a general search. There you are. Hey, excuse me, sir. What did this body have on it? Uh, nothing. Nothing. No, I was just going to get another body when you came in and took over. <laughs> you know, I don't ask for much. Respect. <sighs> Stiff drink. Gold. for my men to do what they're fucking told. Put his body in the furnace. Check it for coin. No point in wasting a bolt. Robbing the dead of their valuables and their dignity. A thief taker general exceeds his own reputation. Time to steal that ring back. Nobles never miss an opportunity to admire their own crest.
I have the ring and a new best friend. But it's not over until I get out of here. Nothing changes hands in this city without Basil catching wind of it. He says it's a gift in my line of work. I'm inclined to agree. <sighs> Come on. Someone wants to meet you. <coughs> Why me? Oh, your jolly nature? Your engaging conversation? I don't know. It's the guy you stole the ring for. You must have impressed him. Who is he? He's Orion. One of the guys standing up against the Baron and sticking up for normal people like you and me. Well, me, anyway. <laughs> he speaks a lot of sense, fucking rarity in this place. He's down here helping the poor sods who have the gloom. It's nice to see someone putting their money where their mouth is. And, um, try not to be too, you know, you. <laughs> we need this. <laughs> I saw. It's good that you came, Garrett. You're paying, aren't you? With what little I have, yes. Well, you've bought my attention for now, at least. Good. Please. Walk with me. Baron favors progress over pain, metal and stone over flesh and blood. And look what has happened. I don't get involved in politics. Ah, yes. You pride yourself on being a loner. <sighs> Do you really think you have no stake in this? It works for me. But for how long? Garrett? Uh, Garrett, I'm slipping! Ah! This is your city, too? <clears throat> what happened? You passed out. Are you okay? I'm fine. What do you need from me? I require a book. It's the only one of its kind still known to exist. I'm told it lies hidden somewhere in the House of Blossoms. <sighs> that brothel is busy day and night with the rich and famous. Discretion is the key. I don't normally hold with stealing. But uh, in times like these... A man of politics stealing by proxy. Sounds about right. As right as a thief who steals for a good cause.
I'll get you your book. You will be helping to secure a better future for everyone. I'll remember that. The House of Blossoms. I never went there, but I know someone who did. Aaron. Not enough for my life. I can still see your face. <laughs> There's an old mill in Riverside that Aaron used to call home. I should go take a look inside. Never been here before, have you? Aaron? What's the matter, Garrett? Did I finally get the drop on you? How are you here? You died. Maybe this is where the dead wait when they've got nowhere else to go. And now you're here. Are you dead, Garrett? Follow me to the truth. What do you want from me? I want you to steal a key to the truth. It's from before I left home. Before I became Aaron. But you have to find it yourself. Those are the rules. Start looking. I'll tell you when you're close. You're close. A little further. It's almost as if Aaron wanted me to find something. I can't leave without checking. What is this, and why did Aaron have it? Onto the House of Blossoms. It's marked by red lights, so I find those lights. I find the brothel. Madam's chambers would be a good place to start. If I don't spoil the mood in here, I could fill my pockets too. I think I spotted my cousin here. The mask is an improvement. <laughs> You're so cruel. <laughs> Tell me about your cousin. This is the cause. Pretty. Madam says you're new. Don't touch you're me. You're not in control here. I am. You'll give me what I want or I'll... Don't touch me. Lilac, I think you do it on purpose. You know I don't like to wait. A man as important as I in the Baron's service will always insist on perfection. Is that why you always pick me? Oh, Master Eastwick, you do know how to make a girl feel wonderful. Oh, Lilac, please, do try to listen. Oh? 
I've had a loathsome week planning the new pipe house in Cinderfall over the heads of administrative idiots. Mm. <laughs> mm. I need a soft hand to smooth out the knots. My wife has fingers like Burke's claws. Ooh, a new building, Master Eastwick. Tell me, which one is your finest? My word, girl. There's a sauciness about you this evening. Mm. Come closer. I might just permit you to hear it. <laughs> As my master commands, I'm all ears. <laughs> Are you going to do more than just walk in front of me? Maybe a little touch. Oh, hello. <laughs> oh, <laughs> oh, just a wee bit harder next time. And just a bit. <laughs> I kind of like that. Oh, now I've lost you again. Where have you gone? <sighs> Pinch my nipples a bit, would you? Oh! Oh! <laughs> that was lovely. That was nice, love. Give it to me harder. Just a little harder. Uh -huh. Oh! Come on! Give me all you've got. Give me all you've got, come on! You can do better than that, my love. Ah! Oh! Oh! Harder! Come on! You want more? Yes! More! Give it to me! Oh! <laughs> oh! One more! Oh. One more! <laughs> oh! You are beautiful. Oh! This has gone forgotten for a long time, but history lasts day to day in this city, and it keeps its secrets close. We have that much in common. Punish me, Mother. I've been bad. So bad. Hey! Don't touch me. My leg hurts. What's the matter, oh. General? <sighs> mummy, a little too much for you. I'll never speak of my mother like that again, you little whore! Oh. Get over here. Oh. What's going on here, General? Oh. That's it. Take your black tax and get out of my house. Touch her again, and I'll cut your balls off. Don't test me on this.
I find things that I want to keep, I could put them here. Take a general dragged him off along with some of my graven. He's taken it. I should have known the Baron would do this. You're telling me my friend's been beaten and dragged all because of that book. What's so important about it? It pulled many secrets once thought to be lost. But within it, I believe, there is the key to saving this city, saving all of us from the gloom. And yet I know the Baron would not use it for such good. And now he has it! Basso knew that book was important! Lucky for you, it's still here then. Basso's no idiot. Book! <laughs> Sounds like a good read. Where'd they take Basso? To the keep, but it's well guarded. You can't just walk in the door. That's good. I'm not a big fan of doors. It's not possible. Oh, wait. There may be a way. Go on. Jacob. Loyal, devoted to the cause, wanted to strike the Baron in his heart, so he's been studying the keep for some time. He knows the way in. How do I find this Jacob? Alas, the Baron has him chained up in Greystone as a message to those who might oppose him. Tortured. What a lie. I find my fence. I'll see about your graven. We're not so different, you and I. Garrett. You bring change. One day the people will thank you for that. You think too much of the people. All right. Let's see if Orion's man, Jacob, knows anything. I'll find him at Greystone Plaza. There's a lot of panicking people in Greystone Plaza. I'm guessing it's too late to get anything from Jacob. But I am close to Eastwick's house, the Baron's architect. If anyone knows a back door into the keep, it will be the man who built it. For Basso's sake, I hope the keep is built as strong as they say. Eastwick City House. No one ever called his work subtle. Seems I'm not the only one making a house call tonight. Theodore Eastwick, servant of the Lion. By order of the Baron himself, Elias Northcrest, you are to present yourself to his watch. No sense waiting out here with the gate crashers. 
Getting into the study needs a lighter touch. So you're saying there's a hidden entrance in here somewhere? I said I've often seen the Master enter here, but found it empty when I check upon him. You haven't ever nosed about for it? No, of course not. It wouldn't be my place. Oh. <laughs> Come on, Mother Mulberry. You're talking noble, but you aren't noble. When you're quite finished, I have packing up to do. We're being attacked! Guards! Please! We're being attacked! Guards! Please! That explains his lack of cooperation. First Cornelius, now Eastwick. Being one of the Baron's associates appears to be bad for your health. One way or another, he was going to swing. You were the biggest admirer of your own work. Did you hear that? We're not here in there, Eastwick! You wait here! I think the Seals is coming up. Only Jack in there on boat. This opening at the base, some sort of steam vent or exhaust shaft. It would be suicide to break in through there. That should buy me back the element of surprise. And what's this? The Baron's great safe. Rumored to be the size of a house and filled with gold. Rumored that it... I even wished I had Genevieve with me.
come, sucking bastard. I always thought if anyone was gonna kill her, it'd be me. What are you up to? Oh, wait, 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 wait. You're not thinking about those tall tales about the legendary Great Safe, are you? No one is paying you to risk it. Garrett, if you get out of here alive, I mean, you know, when you get out of here, I'll be at the Siren's Rest in the Southern Quarter. This might be a really bad idea. A great safe. It doesn't disappoint. I'm gonna need bigger lockpicks. punished for your sins. But I understand greed, my friend. Where it comes from. You made it so easy. All I had to do was get you in the building. You see, I know you better than you know yourself. <clears throat> children will do as I say, or you'll feel the sting of my whip. Come here, boy! There's pain here. The screaming, the sick, and the dying. I, I can't block it out anymore. It hurts, Garrett. But underneath all the noise lie the whispers. Follow me, Garrett. And I'll tell you a secret. You grow up strong when you grow up alone. There's no one to help you up. No one to hold you back. Is that why you let me go, Garrett? Because I was the only family you had? We never did see eye to eye. Big Brother always knows best. I tried to help, but you wouldn't listen. You know, I was just thinking the same thing about you. I'm going to make them stop. I want to sleep like you did. Northcrest, he's here. You want to know what happened? Where you've been? Come to the asylum. Moira harbors truths others would sooner forget.
You're here to save me? Ah, <laughs> uh, then you'll need a key. Look behind you. Just steal it. You've never hesitated before. That didn't quite go according to plan, but at least I'm alive. I need to get back to the clock tower and clear my head. Balance, dogs! The revolution has begun! The time has come for the city to face the dawn! So long, Black Tops! Seems the Graven mob has had enough and is out to kill anyone who isn't one of them. That includes me. Best to avoid any confrontation. <sighs> you look almost human, Basil. <laughs> well, if you can survive what they serve here, you can survive on anything. <sighs> How's the hand? Sore. <laughs> like your pride, I'll bet. That shit bucket needs to get what's coming to him. I need a favor. Oh? You still have your boat? Oh, I'd get a room here if I were you. Find yourself a nice gal and bed down until this whole thing blows over. I need to do a little research. It's about Aaron. <sighs> I need to get across to the Moir Asylum. Just let me know when you want to go. I'll be there. If you are buying. Ah, ready to go? <sighs> now I remember why I don't like boats. Well, I hate swimming a whole lot more, so get in. No, I'll take the oars. You row about as well as I can dance. Sure. The exercise will do you some good. <laughs> so, what does Aaron have to do with Moira? Do you believe in ghosts? Huh? Spirits. You know, the dead coming back to haunt the living. Punish them. You think Aaron's haunting you? I don't know, perhaps. I remember a, a ritual. Some kind of an explosion. Aaron died. I'll never forget it. And everything else is... gone. Ah, oh, come on, Garrett. I know you wouldn't have put that gal in harm's way. She'd have put herself there easy enough. There's an answer in here somewhere. I could feel it. This place has gone oddly quiet since there was a riot here. Some patients escaped. A few boats have come in. Nothing has come out. Garrett! I don't know what you expect to find in there, but be careful. Don't become a ghost yourself. I've been a ghost all my life. It's been a long time since this island had a good reputation. Will I really find you here? Hmm. Okay. Seems someone's expecting me.
You shouldn't be here. Is it the asylum that's haunted me? Why were you here? Aaron was here. And the female ward is probably a good start. Doors need power. There's probably a generator down here somewhere. Don't show him you're scared. Don't let him see you lose control. I wanted to stop him. I wanted to save myself, but they won't let me wake up. I need the primal out of the girl now, but do not let her die, no matter the cost. You understand the fear, don't you, Garrett? The fear of being trapped, of being used. Quickly! She's corrupting it! See? Oh, I ruin everything. The primal is dangerous! It must be controlled! No! It's no good. I'll take her back down to the prison level. I thought you died. But it was worse. You did steal the primal that night. Now the Baron wants it back. They spoke about the prison level. Looks like I'm going even deeper into this hole. Poppies arrive on silver trays, and I'm falling into darkness. Why am I alone? Garrett, where are you? What's happening? They deserve to be punished. You were the one I thought I could trust. Follow me to the truth.
here. No! I'll hear you. Quickly! Keep her away from the fighting! She's too important to die in this rock! Too important to be allowed to die. Of course he I hate them. They understand the pain. She is our future! The Northcrest bastards stole me away. Why can't I? Are you with me, Garrett? Someone's gonna die. Maybe I am going crazy. Only one way to find out. The Baron. Back to Northcrest Manor. Back to where it all began. The Baron has Aaron, then I need to break into Northcrest Manor before the mob does. It's time I got some answers. If you're to kill me, make it quick. I need answers, and you better give them to me. Nobody likes my answers. I've heard much about you. There's a power in this earth. An old energy. Primal. To all but the attuned, it is benign. Unseen. Yet it can be channeled, harnessed into productive form. In the past, only small amounts have been controlled. But I... I dreamed bigger. Better. What did you do with Aaron at the asylum? When the stone broke, and the book was destroyed, the energy somehow passed to her. Exposure to this source has a terrifying effect, twisting mind and body. I know what it can do. Where is the girl? I tried removing the energy from her. But when that bastard took Aaron from Moira, he took my dream with her! Who are you talking about? It's Aldous who took the girl. Aldous! You know him better as Orion. My brother. We grew up apart, but I brought him back into the family, into the Awakened. Like us, he was attuned to the Primal. He was there at the ceremony, the ritual helping. And now his fanatics are here for the stone. Why would Orion take the girl? He must be planning another ritual. And you've been a most obedient dog, it would seem. First, he had you steal Cornelius's ring. Hmm? Then the book. The stone from the keep. If he were to find the final... Your eye. You were there, I remember now. You're the missing piece. Good luck with my brother's mob. Baron's next guests have arrived. While they're burning the manor down, I'll head for the ceremony. There's the primal stone piece, but what's this contraption it's sat in? No time to find a manual. I need to get it out somehow.
master thief. Have I come at a bad time? <laughs> Forgive my clumsiness. Since our first encounter, I've always been a bit heavy-footed. Yours I'll have for my mantle piece. <laughs> Something has changed in you, child of the shadows. The balance of the primal is gone. It was talking to you, but you didn't listen. You mean Aaron? The accident didn't just fill her with primal. It fused her with the city. If she dies, with the primal still trapped in her, then it dies too. The city unravels like it never existed. The Baron thought the primal could be removed from her with all the pieces. Third is not the whole. But you have seen the missing piece. Think. Orion. You must go to the cathedral tonight. Once you steal the missing piece from Orion, you need to find a way to take the primal from Eren. And she must not die. Your city needs you, Garrett. I'm no savior. Like it or not, this city and its people define you, Garrett. To be alone, you must have something to be alone from. This was the last cathedral in the city. A ruined home for old gods. Desperate people have hidden in its walls for years. Orion and his graven are just the latest. Inside that rotunda, Orion is administering his cure. Aaron's close, I know it. To 
Today is the day we showed Baron Northcrest that the people are the lifeblood of this city and are not to be ignored. Your pains and fears are soon to be at an end, friends. This is a good day. The power I gift you with here shall repel any suffering affliction that may try to claim you. Once all have been anointed, we shall share this gift to the world. Beyond these shores! Donna, I need, I need that. We need that. Don't you understand what I'm trying to do here? You need to stop, Orion. Stop protecting the people. Stop trying to give them a better life. You're not helping these people. You're sentencing them to death. They may feel good now, but trust me. Their bodies can't handle the primal. No! <laughs> This one's mine. <laughs> the Rat King! Picking pockets like always. I've waited a long time to see you hang, Master Thief. Well, I don't need a noose. It'll be a fucking pleasure to choke the life out of you with my bare hands. Well, it's about time. I could teach the General a life lesson here. Maybe it's better to slip away. You're good. Very good. But I... I came this way while I dealt with the general. That sea air I can smell. The exit must be near. I'm not alone in here. I'm not here to kill anyone. Why do you continue this pursuit, Garrett? 
You want the primal for yourself. I don't care for the energy. I want the girl. Give me the stone. Return it to me and I shall anoint you so you can feel it. It is beautiful, Garrett. You won't save people from the gloom, Orion. You'll just turn them into monsters! You of all people should understand, Garrett! Betrayed by my own blood! He locked me away and destroyed my life as our father did! My brother never deserved such power! People look to me now. Old men, bitter, greedy, fighting over power like dogs with a bone. I will not be pulled. I will not be pushed by anyone. And you, the one who I thought I could trust, even you want the power that I have. Not for the same reasons, Aaron. No. The power's killing you. Oh, so now you care. I almost have. I don't believe you. I don't believe you! I followed your trail this far. Unless I draw the primal out of you, it all comes undone. Is this reality or the primal? Uh... 